So the first thing is listen. So children will ask you something, but they don't always get it right first time, what they're trying to mean. So firstly, paraphrase it back. So are you asking me what A, B and C is? Um, they might say, yes, that's what I'm asking. Or they might say, no, 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 that's not what I mean. And they might need a little bit of help again. Um, if you don't know the answer, say so. I don't know the answer to that, but that's a really interesting question. Um, maybe I can try and find that out with you, or maybe, for example, what happens when we die? I think most of us are ask, asking that question. You might have a faith at home that you have strong beliefs about what happens and that's what you can share with the child then if you don't know and you don't have that faith it is okay to say we don't act, I don't actually know I believe this other people believe this so it'll be interesting to see what you grow up and what you think and what you believe about that um don't worry if you feel you've answered the question badly because it's more important to that child that you paid attention to what they're asking um so for me, that's a huge weight off my shoulders if I'm in a session support when I am supporting a child who's been bereaved at the moment. And that for me is a huge pressure off my shoulders to think, well, actually, I just need to pay attention and listen. 